In Oakland, parents can engage with school priorities in a couple of ways. They can be active participants in their school site councils. Um, they can be either active voting members or they can actually just go and participate and listen and learn about what's happening. They can volunteer in their school communities with our engagement group and uh, be in classrooms but also be engaging with other parents to learn about how school budgets work. They can come to district-wide events to learn about the budgeting process and I think most importantly they can ask questions about how the budget works and how they can engage um, in the various opportunities and make recommendations for what's best for their students. One of the most important pieces uh, when it comes to student achievement is actual parent engagement. And one of the things that our parents really need is to be empowered with the knowledge of how things work, um, how decisions are made, and uh, how they can be supportive of their student as well as the school um, that their student is attending. How are they represented and how we teach and the strategies that we are teaching and as uh... What type of resources do we have? Restricted and unrestricted and we'll talk about what the differences are. Really getting out to uh, parents, calling parents, uh, doing home visits, getting out to the houses, um, letting them know that it's okay for them to come to the campus, support, and let them know that we are partners and we really need to uh, partner in uh, their, their students uh, or their child's education. The school site council um, in Oakland is growing beyond what traditionally people have been thinking about school site councils. We really want it to be the place where all school decisions are made, where school site councils composed of teachers and parents and community members use data to think about how they're making decisions um, in academics but also for programs and services. And it's moving beyond just focusing on a little bit of budget to looking at the whole school and the whole budget. So for me, it's quite simple. We want every student to thrive. What that simply means is that we want our students to, 100% uh, of our students to graduate high school as caring, competent, fully informed, critical thinkers who are prepared for college, career, and community success and have fun. Thank you.